What's up, fuckers? We're back. Hello, you sweet, beautiful bastards. It's been I've, a long I've time. missed you, my children. It's been like three weeks. It has been. It's been a crazy three weeks. I got pregnant, I got an abortion. It was crazy. Yeah. We're back playing this. Much to my displeasure. I forgot how to jump. I forgot that this game was disgusting. That's oh. a lie. I did not. Oh. Well, you suck just as much as you always did. Hey, I, ha I have to remember how to play. You, what? What is, is that? A that's a staff infection, like the one you had. Uh, no, my, mine was cooler. You're, yes, because it was real. And you drained it on my and bed. And right below us gross... is a Yeah, I'll grant you that. What, I mean, let's be honest, what else is it supposed to be? It's like, it has to be a cum stain. It really does. Because there's nothing else white in the human body other than cum. Pus. It's like yellow. Fuck, scab. Like, even bone marrow is like brown? Like, that's that's gotta be cum. I don't know. There's that. nothing else it could be. Don't. I mean, it, this was made in the NES, so they had like limited colors, but, but it's cum. Like, what is this game rated? I thought it was E. There's no way this game maybe, was rated E. Maybe it didn't have a rating. No, this game was made after a the SRB. ESRB was formed. Yeah, I, I, it had to have been. I, I can realize that. Because I think it was Mortal Kombat that uh, made the ESRB a thing. Because it was so violent? I think so. I think it was after Mortal Kombat 1 came out, there were several countries that banned it. Maybe. Okay. Who the fuck knows? What is it rated? It's rated uh, MA13. Really? Yeah. So this is not a children's game. Oh! I forgot about this. Is that a checkpoint? Do you burp fire now? Yeah, I, I ate a hot pepper. So that a yeah, that, that makes sense. You know what? I ate a hot pepper, so now I just burp fucking fire. Yeah, dude. <laughs> fuck this fucking game. Oh, God. Did you like? So you played this as a kid? Yeah, I and love you, this. And you enjoyed it. I love this game. Did, but you never beat Hick Boy. Fuck. And you apparently can't beat Little Blood Drop Man. It's a scab. It's a blood drop man. No, it's a scab. The pits level two continue. Continue. Yes or no? Oh, so those are like the yeah. little the little Shrek's uh, outhouse thing is a checkpoint. Yeah, the little uh, Shrek. So can you get bonus lives? Um, like, it doesn't seem that bonus lives are very effective in this. It's kind of like Ninja Gaiden, really. You could, you just pretty much restart at the beginning of the level no matter what anyway. When you die, because the checkpoints are limited and rare. Yeah. And not very effective in the long run anyway, because you're kind of just back to where you were. Eh. I just have to make do you, sure. Like, how do you get bonus lives? Do, do they just appear sometimes? Yeah, I think so. Do you have, like, a quick, short-range melee attack, or is it only your booger? Booger. Your booger. It's French. French people are the only people with boogers. Proven in fact. Do you heal yourself by doing that? Because your cave went from yellow to red. Or do you just, like, slowly regenerate life? Booger! question. Because if so, that would be a very helpful thing to know. Also, apparently you can kill enemies by jumping on them. Yeah. Who knew, who knew Mario rules applied? Well, officially fuck this game. They fart when you land on them. They fart any time you kill them. Really? Oh my fucking god. You never noticed? What the fuck? <laughs> this game is stupid. This game is the best. This game is stupid. Oh, it's... Stupid. Wow, your score sucks ass. Yeah, it was bad. What is the high score for Booger Man, a pick and flick adventure? Dude, I want to know what the speed runs at for this game. Probably 10 seconds. There's probably some kind of like exploitable glitch where they just beat the game in 10 seconds. I can beat it in like. Alright, let's look up Booger Man any percent speed run. I keep knocking the fucking table. I don't know if it's doing anything. Booger Man, a pick and flick Booger! adventure. Booger! Speed run any percent. Sorry if I'm not talking, guys. I'm kind of focused. You gotta fucking talk. I'm looking at. I don't think anybody has ever bothered to speed run this game. Dude, we need to send this to critical. 
No, I don't think we need to uh, force him to play this. If any of you yeah, watching... I, I, I swear, I don't think anybody's speedrun this game. Really? Yeah. It's I'm not seeing any results for it. No, I can see it. I'm I'm fairly certain this is not a very well-known game, dude. Yeah, you would never heard of it. I never. I mean, to be fair, I've barely heard of Interplay. The only reason I know it exists is because they made the original Fallout games, which I've only played Fallout One, other than the new one that Bethesda makes. It wasn't that good. It was. No. It, it was not my cup of tea. But it it's a different type of game genre than I usually play. It's more like a text-based adventure. No, it's like a. Um, I thought it was all text-based. No, it's not text-based at all. It's a oh. um, real-time strategy. Kind of, yeah. It's more like a strategy kind of sort of thing. It's if you liked um, this is more for the viewers than for you. If you played Final Fantasy Tactics, you'd probably like it because it's a lot like that. But the, my main problem with the game is you have a time limit to beat it, and I always hate it when games give you time limits to beat them. It's the problem I have with, like, Dead Rising. It gives you, like, kind of a, just an anxiety sort of a situation. Like, you have to do this as fast as physically fucking possible, and it kind of takes away from the fun of the game. Alright, so now do that thing where you're, like, booger. I already tried. Doesn't, it doesn't? Alright, so you just pick something up that he'll do then. Because I know you had a yellow cape once, and then you had a red one. Yeah. It's it's something that you just you shove up your ass, and then you feel better about yourself. Alright. Why does Boogerman have the world's largest chin? Like, he out-chins the Crimson Chin. Because it's time to eat some slime! That's exactly why. Like, that's the only reason. What? Whoa. Okay, the controller's that didn't That didn't make any sense. Controller stopped responding for a second. No, you have a big chin because it's time to eat slime? Yeah, dude. Are you fucking retarded? Are you fucking with me, man? Am I in hell? Yes. And this game is just all that I see look more cum. Ooh. Oh, okay, hell. so it's the capes. Yeah. The capes give you more. We might not have seen it because it kind of blends in with the uh, scabs. Yeah, it re blends in with the disgusting red background. Yeah, they're scabs. Yeah, that's what they are. They're not like muscle or sinew. Oh my god, there's a fucking face. Do you see it? No. It's like a cat face. <laughs> unintentional. It's a fucking unintentional cat face. It reminds me of something uh, you'd see on Adult Swim, honestly. Like in the fucking bumps? Yeah. I, I could see it. Back when they did like the... Um, the, all the, the hypnotic shit all the fucking time. The, the weird shit. I feel like Adult Swim created Hypnotoad. I feel like Adult Swim probably did create Hypnotoad. Like They've it, definitely embraced it. Didn't they use him for a bump? I think they did at least once. Oh, nice back when they uh, owned Futurama. Is it like hidden from you? Yeah, I can't get it. Well, fuck that shit. Hey, we're gonna give you extra lives, but oh. in order to get to them, you have to like I think I, break no, through I, the I universe. Think it came well, no, it's probably... Yeah, you have, you have your full health again. Fuck, okay, there we go. Dig through that fucking garbage, I am. you fucking whore. Is... Look, it's another cat face. No! Jump. For some reason... Why the fuck would you jump? Jumping isn't beneficial to you. This game is clearly designed to destroy you from the very beginning. You can tell through the fact that everything is disgusting, and why the hell are we playing this? Because it's my childhood game. But this is a Nostalgia November. Are we doing that again, by the way? I don't know. I'm... <laughs> Unless we can finish 8, probably not. No, we'll just we'll keep playing 8 for Nostalgia November. You want to see something fun? <laughs> what the fuck is that? I just bug out. Yeah, if you uh, tell him to slide down really fast, he freaks the fuck out. Oh. When is the next boss? Uh, Are we there yet? No, not quite. Are we there yet? Oh, oh, maybe I'll be able to build up. Here we go. Is he, gonna, is he gonna build the ladders? There we go. <gasps> Damn! Nope, couldn't reach it. Cause you suck. We were close. We were close, guys. Honestly, that's not the most beneficial way to stack plungers, let it be said. Is there like four levels in each one and then the boss? I think it's six. I could be wrong, give me a sec. Just allow me to open my phone what, here. Was that my brother? What? The Steam account? I think so. <laughs> Uh, there's five. He just ate a fucking booger. He didn't do he, anything. He picked his own booger. Look at that innocent. 
He picked his own He's Blizzard. He's eating weapons of mass destruction. Why does this game exist? That's a tongue. Yeah? See the moles? Why does this game exist? I don't know. Who in Interplay was like, you know what? We're gonna make a game about a guy who has to go it's through so a world of disgustingness it's so that he may save the normal it's world. It's not a world, it is a dimension. It's a world. It's a dimensional world of Warcraft. Ugh. I am not in my brain right now. Cody's on a trip. I am on a trip. Cody's on a trip, but I'm of, the one on biking. Of unparalleled proportion. Dude, I am so fucking tired. And I haven't even done that much today. I'm, oh, shit. That's, I mean, yeah, sure, you're on your drugs. Yeah, because you had your wisdom teeth removed the other day. So I everybody did. How um, that went. There will be a video coming out about that. It's not going to be very long. No, it's not going to be very good either because he didn't, he wasn't, he was more drugged out than he thought apparently. But... I was, and I don't have a lot of memory of what was going There's on. There's a big gap in his memory that can't be explained. It's like fucking the what? first Black Ops game. And, it, and we, he can't be held responsible for it, but he's here now. Like okay. the fact that he forgot that he shot his best friend. You didn't shoot me. No, in Black Ops. Oh. He didn't shoot his best friend. Black Ops 2? He got tricked into shooting his best friend. I'm talking about the first Black Ops. Oh. There's a part where, the part where when you get back to the, um... To wherever the fuck you are with Agent Smith, motherfucker. Oh, yeah. And he's telling you that you couldn't be held accountable for things you did. You because know. you weren't, you were under mind control. Yeah. That wasn't that about a uh, project, whatever. MK Ultra. No. It was the Russians, not the U.S. Uh, uh, Black Ops Two was about MK Ultra, I think. No, Black Ops Two was. Uh, Dude, you've been fucking blazing through this shit. I know. Look at you. <laughs> I'm surprised Whoa. the game hasn't crashed yet either. Yeah, I mean, d f shut the fuck up. I jinxed it. It's gonna crash right as soon as you fight this boss. Revolta. Revolta. Oh, that's not actually that disgusting, really. It's creepy. She's got jizz on her face. Okay. Oh! She's got a fucking toothpick. She, oh, she rips she off. She rips off her own face. I'm not gonna lie. This boss seems a lot easier. Maybe it's because I'm not fighting her, but... There yeah, she is. How many times you gotta hit her? Probably like... She seems to have like a lot of random invincibility frames. And unpredictable invincibility frames are not a fun way to fight a boss. No, probably not. Ah! I think she's supposed she's to be... she's fucking dead yet? I think she's supposed to be sick. She's Revolta. And her attacks are getting faster, so she, maybe she's close to death. What is that? Is it just a giant fucking toothpick? I think so. I think it's supposed to be a toothpick or something. Maybe it's a maybe it's a bone. Whoop! Did she wait for you to hit her? Nope. Like she just what? What even hit you? I don't know. But the game crashed. Game crashed. Yeah. That, that's a good place to end the episode. Yeah, boy. So, next episode, Next time, guys... we'll kill Revolta, maybe. Bye. Bye. Bye.